that looks so juicy, crisp, tender, and well cooked. And I'm gonna see if it tastes as good as it looks. See, this light is not really the light of the sun. This is just. Okay, thank you, thank you. Hello. The Greek dance? Greek dance? Yeah. It's like... <laughs> opa, opa, opa. <laughs> Welcome to Ia, Greece, not Oya. Don't be that tourist. Ia is the place with the most breathtaking views, sunset, and photo shoots. Pay at least 400 euro an hour to do that photo shoot. When are we gonna do a photo shoot like this? It's a dream vacation to go with your significant other, but it's also a heavily encrowded tourist area. I've eaten here two days ago. The views are stellar, but. I'll just leave it at that. Finding quality, authentic Greek food in Ia is possible. Wow, that looks amazing. I want to challenge myself and go on a big fat street Greek tour and do it in this nice white shirt. So come along with me and let's go. So this is the first stop, and this is where we're gonna eat some of the Greek batter. They have the pork, chicken, lamb, and I like how it's visible right there. And it smells so good too. When was the last time something smelled good and didn't taste good? I don't know anything, do you? So I'm excited. Few moments later. Okay, so right now I'm gonna dig into the Greek batter. with the pork, lamb, chicken, and enough of me talking. I'm hungry and let's eat. I'm gonna try not to spill on this white shirt too, but uh, that's the least of my worries. <laughs> I wanna eat some real good Greek. I know, right? Look at this. Good choice. Right, right. Hopefully it's as good as it looks. <laughs> let's dig in. Look at this. That looks so juicy, crisp, tender, and well cooked. And I'm gonna see if it tastes as good as it looks. This is so tender, and how they make it crisp on the outside, and it's really juicy on the inside. There's a lot of protein to feed these muscles here, so I don't feel guilty after eating it. So this is the chicken. Let me try some of the pork. Pork, chicken, lamb. Well, thank you. This looks great. Can't wait to eat this. Thank you. That is extra tasty. This is pretty good by itself, and I'm happy. Let's dig more in. And I almost forgot that there's a little thing called the Greek salad here. Back home in America, I don't even know any other Greek salads that offer such a big portion of the pizza. Better yet, maybe the goat cheese, they call it. I just have the top. Well, that is strong, pure cheese. Fresh crisp and there's no guilt after eating these Greek salads either. <laughs> Man got busy. Guys I can eat this later. I did eat it just for you but I want to get back to this. 
This is the main dish. That's what we're here for. So this is buried and buried amongst a lot of things. And oh, look. Wow. What is this? Wow. So underneath all the chicken, fries, and pork is the lamb. I found it somewhere deep within, and I'm gonna eat it right now. This is really fatty. Uh, watch out for the bones in here though, because I think I chewed on a piece and I had to take it out. The fatty part is where it's at here. So buried underneath this whole Greek platter is this big piece of sausage. Wow, I have a piece of this. Ooh. Oh, I can see some of the green peppers inside too. Yeah. Let's have a bite. Oh, this is really good. I like how they pack all the juices inside too. It has a lot of spices inside. It's really tasty and favorable. And this is my special with the sausage wrapped up with the bread, the pork, and the fries, and a little bit of lemon. And guys, don't do this on a first date, okay? Guys, I can't eat all this alone. This is a whole lot, so I'm gonna have my wife come join me. So here comes the real star of the show. Not even. <laughs> so this is my wife, Ni, and she's gonna come join and help me finish. Let me know what you think or what you wanna try first. Uh, gonna go straight to the meat. I mean, you made it sound like heaven. I have uh, to try it, this. <laughs> but it was similar. <laughs> and then this. Yeah. See, um, I started doing that. I started doing these things by a fourth or fifth date when I knew that she already liked me, okay? okay. There's no turning back, so, but yeah, it tastes really good when you mix everything together like that. And a cute cucumber. Why not? And here we go. Mmm, I am going for round two. I'm so hungry. <laughs> so, okay. uh, I'm digging in. A full on meat eater, <laughs> and I think this is amazing. It's so fatty and flavorful, portions are big. Mm. She's a champ. I think there's a big piece of lamb that's buried right underneath here. Oh, yeah. Oh, <laughs> oh. what is this? Oh, it's like a burger. Oh, yeah, it's it a piece is of burger. lamb. Is it? It's buried right underneath all this food. Okay, try it. Try it. Mm, it is a hamburger. Oh, yeah, it is a hamburger. Well, they have everything in here. Mm. <laughs> and I found something else that was buried underneath this big platter. <laughs> Wait, is this a, is that the last thing that's buried? It? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, okay, that's the last thing that was buried underneath this big platter. Mmm. There's a lot of spices too. Alright guys, we're gonna finish this plate and we still have more places to go, right? Mm -hmm. Right here, boom boom, Piazza Sivlaki. We found it, it's right around the corner. Okay, so right now we're here at the bus terminal where a lot of the buses go from different cities in Santorini. Let's go in. Hey, he's like, hey, 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 it's not messing around. Let's eat. Thank you. Appreciate it. Cool music, cool vibes in this area. Just gotta check it out. This is the last one. Thank you. <laughs> so, right here is a Sovlaki with veal. It is the most popular Greek dish. Wow, this is really tasty and juicy. Now I noticed that there's a lot of seasoning here too. You can taste it right here, which makes it a little bit more spicy. This adds a little bit more kick to it, which is so good. Is this? 
I got an unexpected Greek yogurt because at first we were trying to order the masaki. But they just sold out and they felt kind of bad, which they shouldn't because I'm sure the masaki is really good here. And they wanted to give us this Greek yogurt instead. So I'm not complaining, I'm happy. And of course the strawberries makes it a little cute. The yogurt over here is really thick. This is the real deal. This is not what you buy in the grocery store, all right? I've never had Greek yogurt like this. The honey is something to die for. I wanna try this new thing called the kebab with cheese inside. I wanna go right in. Oh, this thing is soft. Oh, oh. Look at all that cheese inside. This is ridiculously good. I don't know how something with meat inside can be chewy, easy to digest, and have cheese just explode in your mouth when you take a bite of it. She's gonna come join me and sit down again and describe a little bit of the food and tell you what she thinks about it. Here we go. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Try show them this. Wow, that thing is popping right out. So now we're gonna make our own sandwich and we're gonna eat it at the same time. So here yeah, we go. Yeah, let's do it. Three, two, one, go. Mm. I have, have one more bite. My bite was so small. Go, go. Overall, I thought it was a really good experience. Yeah. I highly recommend coming here. So now we're gonna go for some dessert. Here at Lolita's Gelato. Let's go inside. There's people here. Whew. This looks special. Hello. Hello. First time at the shop? First time. First time. So I'm excited. This looks really good. Okay. All of our ice creams are made at the back of the shop. This actually tastes like a sugary, creamy banana. This is so good. I think, I believe that this is the Greek Viagra. Why do they call it the Greek Viagra? I'm not sure. I'm assuming it helps boost with certain things. Let me try. <laughs> Greek Viagra, what a name. <laughs> After one week in Ia, we found a restaurant with breathtaking views and good food for a reasonable price. I recommend this place to eat. Rosé, hot chocolate with whipped cream, tzatziki, and a homemade bread. And that's just appetizers. So that's it guys for the Greek street food tour. Mission was accomplished. We're able to find good Greek food for reasonable prices and my t-shirt didn't get dirty. Follow me at Hawaiian Traveler on Instagram. That's located on the bottom below. Like, share, and subscribe to this channel. And leave me a comment down below if there's any other videos you want to see me do. In the meantime, I'm gonna go back to my apartment and hopefully catch the sunset. Have a great day and aloha. With you. Freedom or death? Man, I I choose freedom, so. Sirtaki. Zorba, Sirtaki. Opa. 
Opa. Oh, my pants. 